Hi everyone. AI is evolving at such high pace. We've been in contact with the CEO of TripoSR, specialized in 3D generation, and who is also collaborating with Stability AI. In this video, I'll explain you how to launch the open source version on Comfy UI, and also show you briefly some use cases of those models. Afterwards, I show you how to launch it on their platform and on Hugging Face. So first, why should you be interested in that technology? The results often might not be usable. However, combined with other methods like AnimateDiff, the 3D model will allow us to have more control in space and in the movement of the model. Imagine how useful it could be for 3D artists to create assets, furnitures, models from simple text prompt. Also, I'm suspecting that the quality of videos made with Sora is possible because of the understanding of 3D spatial representation. We'll wait and see. Alright, let's start first with Comfy UI. The founder behind Floaty has released the open source custom node for Comfy UI. It's pretty simple. Clone the repo or install the custom node. Download the TripoSR CPKT file from Hugging Face and place in the right folder. Now if you don't have a good computer, or didn't have Comfy UI installed yet, let me show you this method. Float is one of the easiest and quickest way to get into Comfy UI with zero setup. For full disclosure, I'm not sponsored by Floaty, I just really like the platform and the person behind it. Though it's very convenient, there are still many things to improve. But I'll talk more about it in future videos. To begin, you can either download the workflow for free, or if you just want to plug and play with the workflow. Just click try on the cloud. As you can see the workflow is pretty simple. You choose your favorite checkpoints. It has a prompt node, where you input your desired prompts. It will produce an image, and afterwards, remove the background. Then in the last part, it will generate the 3D model. It will automatically be saved in .obj file, so that you can use it in any 3D software. Alright, let's take a look at TripoSR official platform. Once you registered, you will see a gallery of 3D models and a prompt box in the bottom, simply write what you have in mind. And it will create for draft of the 3D generation. Once you selected one, you will be able to manipulate it in 3D and also save it in multiple 3D file. In the bottom right corner, you will also see a refine button. That will allow to generate a more detailed 3D model, however, this could take quite long, around 9 minutes. I've tried to refine a woman's head with a Shinyan hairstyle, which looks okay. And I've also tried to generate a vase and a full hand. I was quite impressed by the accuracy, for which AI is usually not good at. Wait. Never mind, it created a double face hand, haha. Ha. To end this video, you can also check out the Hugging Face link. Where you can try to upload an image and it will generate it in 3D. Thank you for watching. If you stayed until the end, I'll have more surprise for you regarding Floaty to help you getting into Comfy UI.